Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. I hope that you are all doing really, really well. Hello to all of my new subscribers as well. If you are new here, I am literally so incredibly happy to meet you. If you haven't already, please make sure that you do hit the subscribe button below. Make sure that you guys have turned on the bell notification as well to make sure that you guys do not miss any single one of my uploads. So as you can see from the title below, a bit of Primark again and, uh, and I'm not gonna lie to you, I wasn't overly impressed, I won't lie. Now, if you're not aware or if you are new here, um, in June I am going to Ibiza and it will all be getting filmed for you guys. Trust me, it's going to be comedy gold. It is going to be comedy gold. Apologise in advance at the absolute state that I will be in. It's all for the content. Now, like I say, I go in June and we go, I think it's the 7th of June that we go, so... I know that's like, what, eight, nine weeks away, but the thing is, is I need to like get outfits sorted because like we're doing like events, so I need to be prepared for the events. Yeah, so I had to put some outfits together and I feel like I sort of did that thing. I did a bit of like a panic thing where um, I kind of sort of just went in, even though I don't go for another eight weeks, I feel like them eight weeks are going to come around really quickly and I need to sort of start getting some stuff sorted. So what I've told myself I'm going to do is I've actually got a lot of shorts and stuff uh, from like previous holidays and like what I've just bought in general for summer. So I'm going to pull everything out of my wardrobe, see what I've got, see what I need and then literally just buy the things that I need. And I'm not going to lie, when I went I won, I won impressed. I won impressed, I'm not going to lie. It's obvious that they've still got a lot of like autumn winter stuff in and like that season's kind of sort of going and they're gradually like getting in like the spring summer bits they did have a lot of like sewing shorts but without sounding awful just my personal opinion and my taste i thought a lot of them were very tacky um i want like some like really nice fun like prints and stuff like that but i'm not really a print wearing kind of a guy but i think for a beefer i will try and sort of like switch it up a bit but you know me i like my neutrals i like my very minimalist style i think it looks really nice it's very much my aesthetic but i did pick up some um nice bits um so i'm just gonna dive straight in. i've got two bags so the first thing that i've got which i'm definitely keeping but when i tried them on i was like oh, i didn't realize that's how they were <clears throat> but i am still keeping them and it is these shorts here i don't know if the ring lights blurring them out a bit but they are a mint green and white pin striped uh, pair of shorts and these are an extra large and they were seven pound and they're really really nice they're a really really nice material my mum said that this material is like um did you say cheese material cheese bag material cheese draining material i don't know she said some word that i never heard of before but she said it was like that kind of material it's really really soft and it's really really comfortable it's very light airy and breezy it's going to obviously be hot now the only problem with these is I didn't realise when I bought them <clears throat> is until I tried them on they are like literally completely see-through and when I say see-through I don't know if you can see like they are see-through so I'm going to have to wear a pair of white boxes with these um, so if I go in the water in these as well I'm going to have to wear boxes when I go in the swim pool and the sea, which I'm not really a fan of, I like to just sort of like just wear these and not else underneath. I find boxers really uncomfortable to wear under like shorts and stuff. Um, well, shorts like this anyway. Um, but yeah, but they're really, really, really nice. But like I say, you're going to have to wear like white boxers with them. I suppose you could wear black, but you'd really be able to see them. You'll still be able to see the white ones, but I don't think it would be as noticeable with these and as you can see they've got a drawstring and elastic band waist i need to be putting like outfits together so i was thinking on one of the nights i've got like these jean shorts now i've not worn a pair of jean shorts in a really 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 long time and i put these on and to be honest with you the sizing in primark like we all know it's just mad like i'm i range from like I, i'm usually like a 38 waist in everything or a 36 so these are a 36 these that i've got here and they fit okay they don't fit me exactly how i would want them to they're, they're a little bit tight kind of like around the waist but i could kind of sort of get away with it and i was thinking these with a pair of nice shoes i don't i need to think of what shoes i need to wear as well this is what i mean like i've got trainers but then i also need like some nicer shoes for like other events like can i just wear like air force 270s like air force can i wear like air max 270s like 
to Ocean Beach. Like, I don't know what the vibe is like. Do you know what I mean? Like, I need to sort of, like, figure it out. But, yeah, so these are the two things here. They're like a, um, they're like a, like a light neutral beige. I'll tell you exactly what colour they are. They are stone. That's what they're called, stone. And the price of these were £10. And they are the relaxed straight twill short. Um, and they're a Europe size 46. And then they've just got the two pockets at the back. I don't know if I've said the price. They were £10, but I don't like how they fit. So they are definitely going back. I've then got another pair of them shorts but in a light cream colour now these are really like the colour of but the fit these are a 38 and these are way too tight that's what i mean like these are a 36 and they fit me all right but not the best with whereas these are a 38 and literally i'm like like this <clears throat> trying to get them round and these are in i don't even know what colour these are in. i don't really say a colour and they are the made use and sustainable cotton ones um and these are these are like the stretch ones as well, but they're still they're still tight. There's not there's not much stretch in them to say they're supposed to be stretch. So they were ten pound as well. They are going back to the exact same two pockets on the back, and also as well they are buttons up as well. I don't know if you can see the buttons. They're not. Um, I prefer a zip on jeans. I find um, buttons to be a little bit annoying. And then I thought. What about something like a, like a lighter material? So I've not worn chinos, oh my god, since like college, mate. Like I am worn, I'm not a chino where it's like, they're not like really my, my thing. But I did see these chino shorts and I thought they were quite nice because they're very much thin. They're very like thin, you know what I mean? It's like that very more chino, thin chino material. Um, again, these were 38 and these got absolutely nowhere near me. Like nowhere near me. And these were, again, I think £10. Or these were £6. Like, £6 for them is really good. Like, I was thinking with a nice shirt, maybe some nice boat shoes or something like that. But they've got to go back because they're too small. So, out of all of this stuff so far, I'm only keeping these shorts. Which I'm a bit gutted about because I did see some other black denim shorts with rips in. So, I might go back. Well, I'm going back tomorrow to return of that stuff. So I'm going to try and see if can I exchange some stuff for some other bits. Now, obviously, would it be a Primark haul, right, if I didn't buy a hoodie? Now, I know it's coming into spring, but in the UK currently, we've been having very bipolar weather. Like, I didn't realise that in one day I could get a suntan and hypothermia in the same day. But apparently in England, in April, you can. It's actually freezing, that's why I've got this on today. This is also from Primark as well. I will link my previous Primark haul in the down below so you guys can go and watch it if you want. Um, and I got this from Primark as well. And when I picked up this, I saw this, but they didn't have it in my size. It's this here, it's like this moss green hoodie. Very, very, very similar style to the one that I've got on. And then on the back, it says this. It says Pasadena Racket Academy. And it's just got rackets and the racket ball on the back there, as you can see. And then on the front, it's got the logo on the chest right there, as you guys can see. And this was £12. Now, I'm keeping it. The only thing... That I've got about this is even though it's supposed to be very like similar to this this hoodie is thicker than this like the hoodie on this is much heavier than this um, it is good quality I must say for 12 quid but I feel like this fits me a bit better like this one you can't see but the waistband on this is quite tight so I took it under and I like how that looks whereas this waistband on this hoodie is not and you can probably see it's a little bit baggier so when I took it under, it just falls down. So I've literally got to wear it like just like that with like that down like that, which I don't mind doing it, but I would prefer it if I could like tuck it up. But yeah, I'm I'm going to keep it. I, I've got a feeling it may be the way that it's been cut. You know, the, the material has been cut. But I'm not sure. But yeah, I'm definitely keeping it. I tried it on and I love the colour of it. Um, I'm trying to branch out into like wearing just like a few more colours. Like I would never have thought of wearing like a blue hoodie like this. But literally everybody that has seen me in it has said it suits me so much. And I do agree with them. I think this colour blue that like, I love, I think it's really, really nice. And I think it just, it sort of like just lifts 
like my skin tone and my image my eyes stand out more and stuff like that so the next bag that i've got or should i say the same bag is these shorts here that i picked up now these i absolutely love i love these again a little bit see-through not as see-through as the other ones and these are in an extra large and these were five pound also as well that hoodie is in a double xl because i like my hoodies just a little bit bigger not too oversized because i don't like things really oversized on me because i feel like they make them look bigger than they actually am but these are in a extra large and they were five pound and i love them they've got the drawstring they've got the pocket at the back and i think this with um a nice vest a nice t-shirt a nice shirt it look really really nice and again it's got them annoying netting that i'm going to cut out but i think for five pound they're really really nice they want a lot of these left and they want a lot of the other striped shorts left either uh, that's one thing that i would say if you do want some summer stuff and you want to get it from primark i would go now because um when i was in there there were loads of people stocking up on like holiday clothes towels the sun cream everything like they were stocking up on it like literally baskets full like me i was the same i like baskets full of stuff um so i would say if you want to get some stuff from primark i would go now and i would keep going i'm going to keep going and keep checking like throughout like the weeks and stuff and getting like bits and everything but um i'm also going to look on sheen as well i know i did a video on sheen last year i don't know if you guys have seen it. i don't know if i've taken it down now actually as well i don't know if it's still up on my channel and i was not impressed at all with the quality of the clothes but i went back on because the thing is when i go to a beef like i'm gonna be pissed all the time so it's like i don't want to be well, i'm not wearing all expensive that's going to get ruined because i'm just going to be a state so the, the clothes that I, I bring on all day with me i'm not i'm not taking out really expensive like i'm going primark and like sheen and stuff like i'm not i might go on boo man as well i'm not taking out like well expensive like i look banging trust me i will look banging but i'm not buying out that's like i have to take out that's expensive do you know what i mean and then the last thing that i've got and i'm absolutely sure if this don't fit but again it's a t-shirt and i said before like there's no stretch in any of the lads tops there is no stretch so if you're a thicker boy like me you're a bit fucked really to be honest with you apart from if you get an oversized hoodie like this because the t-shirts they're like a box and there's no stretch like when i say no stretch right like you go like this and your arms just stop like usually you know i'm a thicker boy i need to fucking stretch out my clothes a bit do you know what i mean to sort of like get it on and fit me a bit better <clears throat> i saw this and i loved it straight away and i don't know if you're gonna be able to see it all perfectly because of the ring light might blur it out but it's this and it's uh like a green and white pinstripe t-shirt and it's got a pocket on the chest there and it's got like white detailing and it's ribbed and it's got sort of um it's sort of a bit tighter on the arms, so it sort of like fits. But the only thing with this is, I'm going to be honest with you, um, when I put it on, you know the shoulder bits here, they're a fucking square. They'll come off my shoulder, they'll come up like this. It, the fit, it, I think I think this is like a, like a manufacturing bit of a fault because it's like they've just cut it a square. They haven't cut it sort of like to like shape your shoulders nicely, like they've cut it as a square so when you wear it on your shoulders it just sort of goes like that and literally this bit here it sticks up off your actual body like you know like this fits me like around my shoulders this done it, it it's like a square so this um is going back but basically there's like literally like there's look there's no stretch at all like there's a tiniest little bit of movement like tiny but that that is not stretch look at that there's no there's literally hardly no movement in that so that's got to go back and this was a this was seven pound now i got this in a double xl right now they did have a triple xl but if i got a triple xl in this it would be so long on me it looked like a shirt dress do you know what i mean like it'd just be way too long so i'm really gutted about this because they had different colors as well they had like a blue one they had this green one they had a yellow one they had um i think they had a gray one um all seven quid but I mean i can't wear it because it's just it just fits me really really badly but i think that is because of the cut of the material when they've cut the material to actually make the t-shirt i think it's just a bit they've just cut it a bit shit but that is literally everything so i know like i never really do like clothing hauls on my channel just because i don't feel like they do that well i don't feel like a lot of people are like that interested in clothing hauls anymore on youtube i don't think it's do you know what i mean even like youtubers that are like really really big like when they upload a clothing haul like 
it's always like the least viewed video like on the channel you know like massive youtubers and stuff so i hope you have enjoyed it um i'm not gonna be doing a, a clothing haul probably again or for like a really 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 long time my next video is going to be a product review which i think you're all going to be really really excited to see um because last time i did it it had an amazing 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 um reaction and um it's my highest gross video yet um on my channel the product that i'm reviewing again uh this week so that video will be up in like three or four days time after this one so i hope that you guys have enjoyed it i hope you've got some ideas of things if you're going away on holiday or whatever um because i've got they've got some really nice bits and they've got some really tacky shit in but they've also got some really nice bits in like this as well um i got a really nice shirt in my wardrobe and i showed it to you guys before and it was a linen shirt and it's new and it's fucking beautiful it was 10 quid and i swear to god if you got a shirt like that in zara it cost about fucking 35 40 quid madness and it were a tenner so i've got my eyes out for some more of them i did see a white one but they only had one size i think small and that fucking definitely is not going around my body uh but yeah so i hope you guys have really really enjoyed this video if you haven't already please do make sure you hit the subscribe button below it really 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 helps me out also as well leave me some nice comments in the comments bar below i absolutely love when you guys like comment in the comments bar and we have a proper like really good conversation like i've been speaking to people from egypt india um australia just like places all over the world like having comment like conversations with me like in the comments bar it's amazing like i really love like the the community that we're growing like it's really good like and thank you again to all my new subscribers it's going amazingly thank you so much i'm all in the green i'm so happy with how my channel is growing um my next target is to hit 500 subscribers so if you've not hit that subscribe button please go and do it right now it's literally just it's either here or here please just go in just it's free just just click it do you know what i mean just click it Hit the bell notification as well so you get notified every time I upload a video and please like this video as well. When you like it, it really helps me because it just pushes my video onto the algorithm and we all know how fucking hard it is to get on the algorithm but we're getting there and I really appreciate it so I would really appreciate if you did that and put my video onto the algorithm and pushed it out there to a wider audience. I really appreciate it. So guys, until I see you got no, what? Sorry, what? No, Dan, no. I'm fucking sweating, look at my hair. Look at me, basically, I went barbers just before I filmed this video and I went with bedhead. And he's tried blow drying my hair and doing it with all the hair powder and stuff but because, because it's bedhead, oh, my skin's getting sore, you know, because I'm sweating. It's getting really sore. Um, that's why I've got my, uh, I've got my hat on. Um, but yeah, so I hope you guys have enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.